Okay, so now we've seen our formula. Let's try and apply this formula in some calculations. It says, if the critical angle of diamond is equal to, is 24 degrees, calculate its refractive index. So the critical angle is the angle that produces a refracted ray that is 90 degrees to the normal. So here, I will say this is my C. And this is my refracted ray my incident rate going back to the last video we had the formula n is equal to 1 over sine c where c represents the critical angle now here we've been asked to calculate the refractive index which is n so n is equal to 1 over sine 24 Now, sine 24 on the calculator, if it is on the DEG mode, which I advise you always put your calculator, you're going to get the answer to be equal to 0 0.4, and then there are other numbers, but I'm going to need only one decimal place. So, N is equal to 1 over 0 0.4, and then 1 over 0 0.4 is equal to 2. Point five, and that is our refractive index so first of all you replace c with the critical angle you are given you calculate sine 24 and then after that you divide one by the answer that you get and that is the refractive index of the diamond stated in this case the diamond has a refractive index n of 2.5